Yo, people, my library. I just finished the book. Good night, Tweetheart. Let's go talk about it. Okay, Good Night, Tweetheart by Teresa Medeiros. It took me a couple months to finish this book because I was reading it bit by bit at a time. In the bathroom, before going to bed, waiting for something to go out the microwave, etc., right? So, uh, she is the New York Times bestselling author of Winter Garden, okay, which I haven't read. Um... But after this one, I'm very interested in what other books she has published. So, so yeah. So in this book, um, you meet two people, Abby and Mark, and basically it's a chat, okay? Two people who never met each other uh, meet on online, okay? And this is the transcript of their conversations, okay? Supposedly on Twitter. Um, and in between the chats, uh, there would be these third-person narratives of what the girl is thinking and all that. The chats are pretty funny. Um, they're witty, very sarcastic. Um, lots of references to movies, books, TV shows, celebrities, whatever, right? So it's just one chat after another. Um, the girl is an author who is in a state of writer's block. And the dude is a professor who's traveling the world, okay? And each chat is like flirting, playful banter, pretty much, okay? And each conversation uh, pretty much starts and ends the same way, okay? <laughs> like one of them would ask, like, what are you wearing? And the other would reference an outfit worn by some celebrity in a movie or whatever. And uh, pretty much it just goes back and forth and... The last line of each chat, or at least most of them anyway, um, ends with good night, tweet hard, okay? Um, so it is very clever dialogue. It kept me entertained for sure. Um, and yes, at the end, there's like a twist, okay? Um, one of them reveals something to the other that makes the other say, should I go meet this person, etc., okay? So, I don't want to spoil it, but at the end of the video, I'll, I'll say my goodbyes and, and you can choose to stop watching there or listen to the ending, okay? So, I'm going to have like a, a post credit sort of, sort of thing. So, yeah. Uh, yes, it is fiction. Um, these people really don't really exist, okay? And I tried typing in a couple of the links and looking up their usernames. There's nothing there, okay? So, um... There's there's humor, there's sadness, there's a little of everything, okay? There's a little of everything. It's cool, okay? So, yeah, I give this book a 4 out of 5. It's a good story, but I gotta say, for a good chunk of it, book, I was, like, rolling my eyes. Because <laughs> they're just being silly for, for most of the, the chats. You know, you know when kids say something that's cool? And then their parents do it, and the kids are like, <laughs> you know? Uh, if you're a young person reading this, you'll get that a lot. I don't know, it's hard to explain. Um, so yeah, good book, entertaining. I recommend, okay? So pick it up and follow me on Twitter, okay? And uh, I'll put my link to the, the link to my Twitter on, on the, in the description. So yeah, I'll talk to y'all later. Bye! You're still around. So I'm guessing you want to be spoiled, huh? Well, here's what happened. Uh, Mark, the dude, lied about the traveling the world and all that. Like, the, for a good chunk of the book, he kept sending her pictures and of, of him in Paris and all that, you know. They're fakes, you know, just pictures he t took out of the internet. He's actually sitting in the hospital, very sick, going through chemo, having an... And Ivy stuck in him and all that, you know. And Abby didn't talk to him for a while, you know. She was mad that he, he lied to her the whole time. And she eventually forgave him. And uh, he's, you know, about to die or something and wouldn't give Abby his location. Uh, and she wants to meet him. So she did some research, found him, met him, 
and they said hi, and that's where the book ends, pretty much. Okay, so so yeah, there's like a loose ending, and I don't know if all of Medeiros's books are, are like that, but I thought it was clever. Okay, so yeah, once again, follow me on Twitter. Until next time, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye bye.